Hey, what is going on, guys? It's the Gamer Pro Wars on Steve Bannon. Today's video, this stream is going to be the first stream I'm ever going to upload on this channel for one reason, and it is going to be a trailer breakdown of this thing. Uh, there's not going to be any audio, obviously. If you want to uh, get this video, or if you guys want to watch it by yourself, you can go ahead and do so. But we're going to do it on stream. We're going to do a breakdown of everything you possibly missed in this. This is a minute and 10 seconds of a sneak peek of what you guys are going to see in Revelations. And if you haven't seen this yet, which I bet most of you guys have, it is. In, um, it, you guys are just in for a treat. This is absolutely sick. Let me just get um, the chat going for a second. Give me one sec so I know who is here and who isn't. What is up, Unity Ghost, Max Street, Ethan, and Pedro? How are you guys doing? We're doing the trailer breakdown. This is is absolutely freaking insane when i tell you that i have never been so excited in my life this I, I when i saw this i had to watch like 10 times to see if my brain can process what is going on so some of the things my friend has told me which i didn't even see so we're gonna get straight into it hold up a lot more people are in the chat Dra dax dragon hypes rager gaming yo what is up guys the hype is real 10 people already in the chat let's do this so we're gonna wait about 30 seconds and uh, we're gonna be doing this uh, trailer breakdown. This is absolutely freaking sick. I can't wait to show you what is in this because you, y your mind is gonna be absolutely blown if you haven't seen this, like I've said. What is up, Caddy? How are you doing, or Katie? Uh, Eagle Ray, what's up, my man? Uh, let me just fix my mic a little bit. There we go. And uh, let's jump into it. We have a lot of people. Catholic Gaza, what's up, my man? So let's jump into it. First of all, you guys see the Mature 17, you know, obviously nobody trusts in that. So we're just gonna skip. A couple seconds in until we get every story has a beginning now if you guys didn't know what this is this is the same exact beginning that happened with origins when they said every story has a beginning and I'm gonna show you guys in a it's, it's gonna show up in a couple of seconds another text that pops up so once you keep going I'm gonna try to go frame by frame guys over here you guys see Origins. Now these, uh oh, these are the uh, bunkers of Origins that you guys used to, um, you know, travel under. If you're going to Generator One or Two, it is a bit, you know, it, it looks a bit meaner. If you guys know what I mean, it's not like kind of snowy, rainy like it used to be. It's like more fiery, you know, like more reddish, more saturation. You got, if you know what I mean. But um, this is absolutely amazing. I am so so hyped for this. So Origins. That's the first thing you guys see. Then you head into freaking Noct Durantotin. If you were okay, if you guys look to the left side right here, you see the help door right there to the left hand side, and then there's a fan on the floor. And you guys know this is knocked because of the pillars that are right there. Plus, there is the staircase that leads up. Now, what I'm predicting is this is not going to be a like full knocked remake this is going to be something completely different probably like they're going to add something different to every single other map it's going to be absolutely crazy i am just super super shocked and guys if i can't read chat uh, right now is because i'm doing this on my phone because my other other monitor is on xbox right now and uh, i can't do two computer monitors right now but uh, i will read it after this breakdown so this is not this is absolutely insane i i'm just so freaking excited dude and then you just skip over and then guess what it says here? Cell house, loud talking, shouting, whistling, singing, blood gargling, or other unnecessary noises are not permitted. Where do you guys have, where did you see that sign before? Yes, Mob of the Dead from Black Ops 2. This is going to be a freaking insane map, dude. I have to, I had to have seen this like, like 12 times already and if you guys caught my reaction it would have been the most hilarious thing i was so pumped man we were slamming desks we were doing everything possible because we knew this map is going to be any beat any other fucking map in history man i am so freaking excited man we are going to continue this let's go oh my gosh all right and then, it's, and then the text right there and an end so everything has a beginning and an end exactly what they did with freaking origins i am so excited i really hope it's not an end i really really do not i want them to continue this for another freaking decade or a century or whatever a millennium even i am so so freaking excited let's continue this is uh, unfortunately this is only uh, a minute and 10 seconds which i'm kind of sad about um but that's not that's not gonna do anything oh and over here what does this look familiar to where is takiao standing right now where does this look familiar to well, I'll give you about three seconds. I'll give you about three seconds. He's in the teleporter. He's looking down where? 
Yup, you guys guessed it, Kino Der Toe, and he is in the theater right now. If you, and if you don't know yet, where the Bowie knife is, if you guys can see that, that is actually the staircase leading up. And on the left-hand side, you guys can see the actual map layout. Now, the map layout is exactly where it was. I think that's the, also the box locations um, for where the box was. You know, it had the green light wherever the box was. And then there's trees and everything. You guys know that this is a um, theater because you also see chairs being sunk into the floor. Um, so, you know, something is definitely up. I'm so, so excited to see this, man. I don't know how many times I'm going to say this, but I, I think I'm going to punch myself awake, dude. Yo, Rick Toffin, if you're seeing this, bro, hit me up with a time machine right now because I need to go and play Revelations right now before I fucking have a heart attack. Please, Rick Toffin, give me a time machine. Shit. Okay. Uh... No, nothing interesting in there. We're just doing the same picture. Then, you guys have skulls. Something looks like the origin type of look. Mob of the dead. You know, dead things. You know, this is zombies. Uh, nothing really what we know here. Then, you guys get to this. Now, I don't know if I'm wrong with this, but this looks like a pack-a-punch machine of some sort. Uh, maybe this, you know, dissolves out of stone. And it's like the, the dragon whenever, uh, in Derizon Drac, whenever you um, get the first kill and you... Um, you know, get this dragon to go out of the stone thing. That's probably what you have to do here. I believe maybe this is a soul chest. And then this, I'm going to do a couple frames for you guys. So as you guys saw right there, it is actually a thing just like, how do I explain this? It's like the uh, uh, like the MED room, I think it's called, from Der Eisendrack, where everything just stands up into a gravity and just combines. and Or like the thing from Origins, like the, uh, the Pack-A-Punch, how everything just came up from rocks and, and formed this thing. So I'm going to play a little clip right here for you guys, and boom. So that's pretty much that's pretty much it. So they're not giving this a huge thing, but I can tell you that this is freaking going to be hype. I am so excited for this, boys. I am so freaking excited. Um, this is going to be uploaded to YouTube, so if you're watching this as a YouTube stream or a video, I hope you guys are going to enjoy this. This is going to be absolutely sick. And then... We're going to speed it up. You guys see that, you know, it's not really something interesting. Then, right here is where I wanted to pause it. Right here. As you can see, that is, what's it? Nikolai. I almost forgot his fucking name. And then, look to the left. Generator Station 3. What the actual... Okay, this is obviously Origins. Generator Station 3. If it hasn't, uh, if it hasn't been in implemented into your mind yet that this is Origins, yes. We are getting an Origins remake. I believe that probably half... Half of the map or more is going to be based upon origins, the ancient, you know, staffs, everything, e like premise, freaking everything, dude. I, I, I just, what is wrong with me, dude? I am so excited, dude. My, I, I, it's like I'm on a sugar rush right now, dude. Stay, um, generator station three. So let's just continue, man. And then you have this spinny ballerina thing just spinning and just keep spinning and then you have like these origin lettering where you see these weird kind of hieroglyphics looking on this stone a bunch of different designs looks absolutely amazing then you oh whoa 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 too fast there buddy too fast gold up let's speed oh there we go stop right there now where does this this kind of looks similar let's just uh wait a couple seconds there we go now doesn't this look a little bit similar to Zetsubo no Shima with the people inside the pillar or mob of the dead it can be Zetsubo no Shima or mob of the dead um, th this is just fucking insane, man. I am so, so freaking excited to, for this, guys. I, I just, oh my gosh, dude. This is going to be absolutely crazy. If I'm not looking at the chat, guys, I, again, I'm really, really sorry for that. I don't have it active right now. I'm, I'm just doing this. Once I do finish the live stream, I will be looking at chat, so just give me a couple of seconds. Now, 41 seconds in, this either is Mob of the Dead or Zetsubo no Shima. I'm going to lean towards... Uh, Zetsubo no Shima because of the water that you guys can see on the floor in a couple of seconds. Yeah, it's it, this frame is literally probably like two seconds long. And then you see the boxing glove right there on the top. Now this maybe could be bring uh, bringing us back to Shadows of Evil, which is hype. I mean, I personally loved Shadows of Evil for the first, you know, maybe a couple weeks. You know, I like the just the overall Easter egg of the map. I loved the Apothecans. I loved how you can build the Wonder Weapon overall. But now Shadow Evil is kind of getting stale. But I feel like this map is going to let us upgrade that Apothecan Servant. So let's see what we can do, boys. The next one is... Oh, oh shit. Okay, that is what... I, okay, that is going to be... You, you guys saw what that is. But let's just continue and pause right there. Now, I'm going to roll this for about two seconds and tell me what you guys see in the background moving right in front of Nikolai. Tell me that does not look like a freaking dragon to you. Tell me that's some creature that's going to pop up and eat your fucking nose off while your eyes are going to be dissolved into acid. I don't know what the fuck I just said there, but 
That's a dragon. That has to be something scaly. A lizard, a dragon, a freaking t Teletubby. I don't know. Dude, this thing is getting me hyped, man. I'm so happy I got a PS4, man. If, if I had to sit through this on Xbox One, I think I would have just shot myself in the head by now. I, I just... Okay, I gotta calm down. Just relax. It's okay. Just and let's just continue it. Okay, no calming down. We're doing this. Um, let's just go here. And what does this look like? What the fuck? Why is it all black? Come on. It was literally there. What does this look like? The best map ever, right? Der Eisendrag. Yes. What the hell just happened here? Why is everything just up? Why is everything? Just all over the place like the MED just completely fucked up like the gravity room just messed up and just launched everything up what is this bro i am i have so many questions the if you, if you guys can see the roof also is just like broken off uh can you see the dragon over there is a the dragon still there i don't know but there's just so many questions man i it, is der eisendrag in this map is are we teleporting to different maps in this map like there's so many questions that can be asked in this that you just you really just like what you just don't know what's going on man you really just and you are so confused and this sneak peek has gotten just everybody at a sugar rush level that wants to punch everything bro oh we i'm so excited man i'm so oh my gosh if you guys haven't noticed that and rick toffin with the blood vials this oh, oh my god is beautiful baby oh my god wait bam you got Tictacchio on the right, Dempsey in the middle, baby, and Rick Toffin on the left. Guys, I, I think I'm going to collapse, man. I literally have freaking goosebumps all over my body right now, dude. I need this map right now. Oh my gosh, dude. This map is going to be fucking insane. The Easter egg. I just want to see the Easter egg. I want to complete that. Oh, boys. Oh my gosh. So, these are the premise, I guess, like ancient keeper or whatever the fuck they want to call it but we're gonna continue then you have uh right here dempsey with the uh you know the mr6 you guys missed it but it was a pretty long couple seconds right there dempsey with the mr6 pistol uh he the surrounding area the environment behind him i have never seen before it looks like on the left hand side right by dempsey's right arm you guys can see this green maybe watery gooey thing um i have no idea maybe this is a new part of a map that they just created nothing Remakey, I guess you can call it. I don't fucking know. Okay. And over here is, if you guys haven't noticed it yet, it's Shangri-La. These are the gates to when you open Pack-a-Punch. Now, on the right-hand side, there used to be something like a Rick... I forgot, Rick and something. But you guys can see right in the middle that there's that green light. Now, what I believe that is, that is Pack-a-Punch. I'm not going to say it's Pack-a-Punch for sure. Maybe it's just a green light. Maybe, I, I don't know. But there's just so many things that you have questions about. This. Now, man, right here. Maxis holding the KRM. I'm pretty sure that is the KRM. And he's like, Maxis. And th it, th that just when he said that, that struggle and that scenery of when he said Rick uh, Maxis got me freaking hyped and chills all over my body. And I think I'm going. It's like you, your nipples are hard, bro. I'm, I'm I, as gay as that sounds, but when you go into a cold pool and you're all in goosebumps and your nipples are hard, that's exactly what happened to me when this happened. Now, I don't have no words, bro. I literally have no freaking words for this. This is absolutely mind blowing, dude. All right, so let's continue, bomb. Let's just um, play this with no sound because I, I don't want to, you know, may possibly get copyrighted. So let's see what we have here, boys. Then, oh, oh gosh, you have this. Hold on, let me just enlarge this. Some orb thing. Now, what I think this is, is it's something leading to the house. Something in particular that can lead you to the house, possibly? I don't... I, I, there's so many questions, man. I just... I'm so confused, and I'm... Oh, gosh, man. I am just... Oh, what the... <laughs> if you guys know what the hell this can be, maybe... Oh, my gosh. This is probably going to be the ending cutscene to the Easter egg. I already know it. And then, that is pretty much it. And then you guys can see on the bottom right-hand corner, not actual in-game footage. I, I don't know what to say, guys. This is just an absolute mind fuck. It is just absolutely like, what is going on? We do not know. I am so excited to see this gameplay trailer. Now that this has gone live, 
If you haven't seen my exact date of which DLC 4 is going to be released, go watch that now because now I am pretty much 100% sure that those dates that I gave you are real. They are actually 100% real that I actually, you know, probably just predict the future because now I feel like we're going to get actual gameplay trailer image thing in just a week's time, not even like six days we're going to get the actual trailer and I am so freaking excited, man. And then after this, it is pretty much just the, um, what's it called? We just have the revelations again. Oh, boys, you need to, like, calm down for a second here. Oh, gosh. Yes, we just got a lot. As, as much as that I want to say that we didn't get enough information, they pretty much gave us the whole map. There's, like, 10 or 11 different maps in this. All remakes, something insane. I am super happy and... I was not expecting this. I was not expecting this. Now, if you guys know, th throughout the day, they've been giving us little 15-second trailers, and you have to piece a puzzle. Now, I've been trying to work out how to solve this puzzle. I've got a couple pieces down, but I'm not sure, uh, you know, where exactly to put them because, you know, you need to mess around. If you're good at puzzles, you know how to do this. Um, but, yeah, guys, revelations right there. Oh, boy, man. This, this is going to be one hell of a trailer. This is going to be a trailer of the lifetime. A, oh my, oh my gosh, dude. I just don't know. I, I'm just shocked. But anyways, guys, I'm going to end the stream here. I'm just going to turn it back up in about a couple seconds, just so you know, we'll be playing with all you guys on stream, so I'll be able to see what you uh, what you guys are saying and how hyped are you for this DLC for Relations. As always, if you're watching this as a video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you guys are new. And as always, I will see you in my next video tomorrow. Peace out.